there is nothing more familiar or more mysterious, more breathtaking in its action, marvelous in its mechanics, exquisite in its range of senses, and staggering in its ability to understand. On a fantastic voyage through a single day, we plunge deep into the routine miracles of the human body. Our instruments, engines, infrastructure, roadways and circuitry. Through 10,000 blinks, 20,000 breaths, 100,000 beats. Today is an ordinary, extraordinary day in the life of the incredible human machine. Bits of stardust is really all we are. Oxygen, carbon, hydrogen, and a handful of elements that would cost very little at any chemical supply shop. But get these chemicals together, marinate in a hospitable place for about 3.8 billion years, and the mundane mix of molecules becomes precious. There are more than six billion human bodies living on Earth, and each of us is the amalgamation of some 100 trillion microscopic cells. While the blueprint for each individual are 99.9% .9 identical, no two of us are exactly the same. As a new day dawns, each human machine begins the succession of miracles that will take it from morning to midnight. Cells, senses, muscles, Bones, hearts, brains, all must marshal their forces and unite just to wake us up. <sighs> At the surface of it all, a velvety overcoat of cells and protein keeps us in and the rest of the world out. It's our armor, our radiator, our entree to pain and pleasure. It is the body's largest organ, our skin. Smooth and silky to the eyes and touch. A closer look presents a very different landscape. Magnified 600 times, our outermost skin is nothing but dead cells riddled with ridges and grooves, and pocked with countless bumps and holes. Look closer still, and we find hundreds of thousands of bacteria inhabit every square inch of us. With every tick of the clock, our dead skin gets sloughed off. We shed at least 600,000 particles of skin an hour, about a pound and a half's worth each year, which accounts for as much as 80% of the dust in our houses. But there's plenty of skin to go around. If we could peel it off and lay it out flat, the average person's skin would cover some 18 square feet. Though just millimeters thick, it would weigh about six pounds. And we're constantly making more. Just wait a month or so, and you'll have a shiny new coat. Which means skin can't be all dead. Dip below the surface and you find cells continuously dividing to replace those dead cells above. Kilometers of